If this bill passes, we will become a national laughingstock and eyesore to this state. It's time to recognize that more freedom, freedom for everyone benefits everyone and harms no one. Passion from both sides tonight as the Texas A&M Student Senate takes up the religious funding exemption bill. Good evening, I'm Emily Jaster. Thanks for joining us. I'm Stephen Romo. There was standing room only at tonight's Senate meeting and a controversial bill just passed. A discussion just wrapped up about five minutes ago. That bill actually passed 35-28. They just took that vote. KXHD News reporter Chris Vallejos is just back from that meeting. So, Chris, tell us about that atmosphere. We saw passion from those two people at the beginning of the show there. There was passion and there was also a noticeable division in the room. An hour of people speaking about the issue and the Senate, as you said, now just coming to that conclusion on the vote. The bill proposed last week, now called the Religious Funding Exemption Bill, would allow students the right to opt out of paying specific student fees for organizations they are religiously opposed to, which sat well with some at the meeting, but not others. We're talking about a constitutional right that everyone has, and I don't feel like um, it's discriminatory for some students to be able to opt out of funding uh, things that they oppose to morally. I consider myself a spiritual individual, but if I want to opt out of funding departments that say um, anti-gay um, things, or if I want to defund organizations that attack the GLBT community, I have no grounds to do that. Again, within the last five minutes, the Senate elected to pass that bill 35 to 28, and many who I spoke to were completely against it, saying it's morally wrong and could set a bad precedent, but clearly the Senate didn't feel that way. Stephen?